This week on Fan Service, we talk about My Hero Academia. Detectives with guns for their faces. Food Wars. And Christian Bale's Burrito Son. Someone just do it. Someone just, someone do it. No, not that. No, no, I think that's it. (laughs) You think that's how we're starting? You think that's how we're starting the episode? I think we've already started. Yeah, we just started. Oh my God. Hey, everyone. First off, happy birthday. Yeah. Today is the actual, three years ago today is when fan service won, when fan service was actually fan service started. What is fan service, you ask? Fan service is Rooster Teeth's official anime podcast. Mm -hmm. I didn't ask because I already knew because I'm smart, an intellectual, big brained. And if you don't know, small brain. But you, when you learn, big, big brain. brain. Oh my God. Nice, 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 nice. Who's nice, big brain? Nice, 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 uh, nice, nice. I'm uh, I'm Carrie, big brain, Shawcross. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm Miles. Reg brain, reg brain, L- Luna, Atlas, regulation, Atlas. Miles, Atlas, Atlas. Uh, Luna. Yes. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I, I, was I was about to say. I was about to say. Do people know me for wearing a hat, but after last episode, they do. Yeah. It <laughs> is in the wings. In case, just hey, can you haw that over here? I miss, it. It's my just in case I start developing another migraine hat. I miss one episode and all of a sudden yeah. I'm, I miss I'm the cowboy hat guy. Okay, yeah, cool, yeah, cool. yeah. Miles is officially the. Okay. Uh, it kind of looks like a fedora. Don't, a little bit. don't make it, it worse. It looks like a fedora. Don't make it worse. We have to get him a fedora. Um, I'm Cole. I don't have a middle name. <laughs> how would you How would you describe your brain in one word? Horny. I was gonna say. Yep. Yes. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Could it be better? <laughs> yeah. Isa. I'm Isa. Uh, I'm more than one brain cell, Isa. Oh. Whoa. That's fucking good. brag. I got the I horny brain cell. He got the big brain cell. Yeah. yeah. No hat brain cell. No. no. Yeah. The cold brain cell. Cold it's like, brain. where's my where's my home that keeps me sheltered? My thing. I know I said big brain. One cell though. <laughs> one one cell. Cell. big yeah. cell. Yeah. You know, how, like most brains have all the wrinkles. Yours just looks like a big fucking like everlasting gobstopper. <laughs> just just in no there. seam. Super smooth. Yeah. Do you know Extremely that uh, very smooth. Christian University in uh, Texas? Baylor. The, the Texas Christian University. Oh yeah. TCU. That one? Their mm-hmm. mascot is the horny toad. Oh yeah. What are they oh. thinking? I'm mad at them. Yeah, maybe it's a test for their students. <gasps> Are you turned on by this toad? Well, I didn't mean it like that. But... <laughs> <laughs> Saying more like if you the make one jokes. Guy's like, yeah, oh, I mean, yeah. No. I mean, <laughs> if it was an anime, yes. What is? Because there's a I'm term. I'm attracted to my sister, the toad. So like scalies nice. are like if you're a furry for reptilian things. I'm not yes. going to comment yes. on that. I don't know. What is? What would? What would? There's it, a term am, for birds am, as well. Amphibiany. Oh. Am, am, slimies. Slimies. Those are slimies. That, that, that slimies. seems like, and I don't mean this to be negative for anybody, that seems like the slur yeah. that they oh. wouldn't like oh. and that there would actually Fair. be like a nicer. Webbies. That's no, that sounds like the, what you are, which is someone who does want to fuck a spider woman. I think woman. that's also an award the company's oh, yeah. won, so it's probably <laughs> not that. Yeah. Um, man, mm. this is a start. You can look up Ragnarok from Monster Musume and tell me you don't have feelings. I... <laughs> I that is I didn't even know what half of the words in that sentence meant. Well, we'll figure it out. <laughs> hey, okay. This is an anime podcast, right? Yeah. Obviously, obviously. And we've been watching anime. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's true. It's a, it's a new season. We last time I was on, we previewed the new season. Yes. So you were out. I filled them in a little bit on Assassin's Pride. I heard. I heard. We had um what we so Miles and I have been trying something, which we definitely want to get you guys in on. We need to. Figure out some of the kinks first because this is one of trial runs. Cole. We've been having uh, anime and hot tub night. Yes. Yeah. We realized the last anime and hot tub hot tub night was actually sick boy soup night, oh. where two boys get in a hot tub and come out far sicker. One than One of they them got was in. a little sick at the time, yeah. and then after that, one of them was very sick at the time, and then after that, another one was very very sick. Very sick. Yeah. We all now when you're in the hot tub, we're at least five feet apart. Uh, I know the meme that you're referencing, but if I'm gonna be honest, it's not that big of a hot tub. And we wouldn't be five feet apart anyways. Because we are always so close. Yeah, yes. the correct answer is no. Yeah. We were not five there feet apart. There we go. Oh, Kyle, Kyle just yeah. threw up. Thank you, okay. Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> For reference, Isa, oh. what's that? Because what's that, what's that audio clip that we keep referencing so people can discover it on their own? I, I Oh, man. The title. Nice, 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 nice. Cutest Japanese girl in VChat. So VR there's chat. some VR yes, chat. It's very sorry. good. 
So Japanese girl oh on VR chat. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, nice, 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 we won't spoil nice, it. Just, just so, check out yeah, the video. Yeah, uh, yeah, so Assassin's Pride. Why don't y'all figure out your soup thing and then we'll join. Yeah, you. yeah, yeah. 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 Well, so yeah, I yeah. let them know Assassin's Pride. Dude, soup's uh, not line. wasn't my favorite. Yeah. Did not necessarily immediately grab me. I liked that it actually started with something. Like Fair. there was a cool fight scene and it wasn't like boy transported to another world. Yeah, and yeah. I love the the world building. Like the entire world lives. It looks a like a giant chandelier. chandelier. Yeah, it's or like, like candelabra. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And it's like, oh, there's monsters outside of this. These are the only places that have energy left to keep yeah. them safe. So that didn't particularly grab me. But then this past week, I did watch one of the other shows that we had kind of previewed. I you, and Sherry, I you and Carrie, you and Carrie both. I watched. think you watched too. Okay. Uh, no Guns Life. Yeah. Oh. This is the show with the noir detective with a fucking revolver for a head. Yeah. Cool. It's okay. His name is Resolver. Yeah. Well, that's not it. But that's that's his yeah. nickname. This is he has name. he has a full okay. name, but he's you're right, he's, you're right. he's known as the Resolver because yeah. he resolves problems in his neck of the. Yeah. He's your friendly Hence. neighborhood he, gunhead man. Hence. Does every show begin with the crime happening? The, him showing up, seeing the dead person, him giving a uh, pun about yeah. said dead person, and then putting on a pair of gl- sunglasses and a hit song by the Who plays. I have to assume they're building to that. Okay, I have yeah. to. Assume I have only seen the first that. episode. Same. Okay. Same. Um, Does it smoke? The gun when he fires it, oh. I don't know because so, he hasn't fired it yet. He has a smoking fired it. gun now. But to be clear, then the, the original question I thought you were asking: the gunman smokes cigarettes. That's true. The gun does smoke. So he does smoke. smoking barrel. Oh my god, he's a smoking gun. That's great. yeah. So it is literally. Oh. I feel like, and I and I I don't mean this in a bad way, but I completely expect people to take it in a bad way. Do y'all remember the movie called The Spirit? Oh yeah. God! Like vaguely on the yeah. edge of like my the memory. Of the spirit. It was like superhero, but he was like this like detective. Kinda. Or maybe I'm mixing up with another movie. I, I don't know. I thought the spirit was a TV series. It was like no, a... it was a movie. Okay, it was a movie. It, he's basically I was it's like the, the Specter or the Phantom. Yeah, yeah. That's, 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 this is an anime, and this is where we stop. Now yeah, it is, it is like <laughs> the most matters. like hard boiled. Like this could just be like a detective. Yeah, series. gumshoe detective. Yeah, like yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a uh, the, the really interesting thing about it is uh or the thing I, one of the things I like about it is it's very sci-fi oriented in a, a a sci-fi light way I guess in that yeah it's for the most part I feel like it could or what I've seen so far it could take place like in the near future mm-hmm. um but there's this you know very ghost in the shell like there is uh you can enhance your body yeah. and become extended yeah um and they hint at this idea that during a previous war there were uh, people who were, uh, they're called overextended, um, <laughs> and that are now like, that's not allowed, but extended is still allowed, mm-hmm. and he is this overextended relic. It does mm-hmm. feel like a more fantastical, for lack of a better word, almost cartoony take on mm-hmm. Ghost in the Shell. I, yeah, it, they're- It's they're, more stylized, I guess, into the absurd. Yeah. Like, again, like, Ghost in the Shell, yeah, you have people that are practically weapons, like walking around cyborgs, but like, <laughs> the fact that it's, it's fucking the gun for a head, head, it's like, okay, this is a little, Pushed towards yeah. the absurd. They they definitely have yeah. moments where you can tell, like they know what they're doing, mm-hmm. and that's what I appreciate. Like they, like he has a moment where he gets embarrassed, and like it goes to the like it almost looks like Al from yes uh, yes from a uh, Full uh, Metal, but like they have the white eyes, like oh yeah, like detail goes away. It's just a shape, and like oh like they'll do yeah. some like comedy moments like they, that. They they seem to have like. And they're having fun with it too. Yeah. Like Resolver has a few. Like there's two little like I don't know if you call it a weakness, mm-hmm. but like he gets very flustered by pretty girls. Mm-hmm. Um, oh. Like a pretty girl kisses him on the cheek in the beginning. He's like, oh! And then like at a certain point- He's a, he's a very, dis- in that moment, he had a very like d- Harpole detective line, which is like, w- was, was like women and drinks only cause problems to keep the money yes. or whatever. Yeah, he's just like, yeah. it's this very like, if, tra- not traditional, but like that old timey feel thing. Noir, thing. Very, kind of yeah. campy. Yeah. Um, and then he has another moment later where like there's a- um, a character who they very go out of the way to show it's like she's wearing almost nothing and has yeah. huge boobs and like I think she's very much supposed to be like a femme fatale type character which is why they're leaning into it so hard. Yeah, I actually was like okay, because th- that's also a film noir thing. Is like oh, it is I'm sexy and dangerous. The, the first time like when I I I think you might have walked in. I don't know if you like I'm watching it in our office and I just go. <laughs> it's, it's just a shot of like. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Nice, 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 um, nice, nice. And I was like, okay, I don't think we need this yet. And then like as it started going, I was like. 
Needs still a strong word. Yes. It yeah. doesn't feel completely unjustified. Yeah. And it, then it leads to another moment where he's like, oh, like, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. The other, the other thing they see. do, the other thing that they do with it is uh, he has a whole fear of uh, humidity in the water because uh, he'll rust. Yeah. Oh, and so okay. that's the thing. He falls in the water and he like kicks out his cylinder and is like, oh, no, I, I got yeah. I got to make sure I don't rust. Uh. I remember in the um, synopsis, it also said that he can't fire his own gun head. Yeah. So that's someone <laughs> else that he trusts. Needs to pull the trigger, and the thing that we established from the and very beginning, because like the he, I don't he trust helps, anyone. Yeah, he helps someone out, and she's like, "When he, why, maybe we partner up." And he's like, "I don't have partners anymore." Yeah, I'll never open myself up. Yeah, like so. Don't it, touch my it's trigger. a it's a pretty. Yeah. The reason I like it, or I, I'm enjoying it so far, at least, mm-hmm. is it's a. Uh, there's a lot of ingredients that are like I know what they're doing. It's the 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 character that came from a war that has this troubled past and is really powerful and is holding back and is trying to do the right thing. And then there's this, you know, other character that, you know, he needs to help for this reason, all this stuff. But the fact that it's just like a dude walking around with a giant gun on his head yeah. is making me go like, okay, yes. like I can tell they're <laughs> playing with it and not yeah. just yes. copying stuff. It's not, it is not strictly derivative. Right. Because there is like, Again, if it wasn't a gunhead man, like they right. have, oh, there's the big corporation yes. that's like, oh, maybe they're Google, not Google is right. actually bad guys. Like, of course, there's yeah. shady stuff going on with the giant corporation. Yeah. And of course, but like it so far feels more like paying homage to these things yes. as opposed to falling prey to old conventions. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, if you haven't seen yeah, this, yeah. Yeah. No, pull up no, a picture, no, no guns, guns life. life. It'll, um, it'll be interesting because I think this week's Psychopaths season three comes out. Oh. oh. Mm. So it's nice, 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 going up against nice, 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 that as far as like that noir. Mm-hmm. The other thing that I'll oh, I'll give you. I'll give it is there was a I'll call it a twist at, yeah. towards the end of the episode yep. that like it is it is it is checking all these boxes of what makes like a, a solid noir story and in the first episode it hits every single mm-hmm. box including a twist that isn't like the twist of the whole, of the whole mystery right but there's almost sort of like an Episode one has its own mini mystery within it, and you get the rev- like you get this revelatory information at the end of the episode that made me legitimately go, "Oh, cool! Yeah, like, that oh, was yeah. really neat." And no. I and I'm I, though I'm not super in love with it yet. I am absolutely going to watch the second episode. So, like the entire time, I'm thinking in my head, "What does this look like?" And what I've been thinking mm-hmm. is kind of similar to something from like Luluco, you know, mm-hmm. where mm-hmm. Luluco saying her they, her transformation into into, into a gun. Mm-hmm. Um, and it's just so like loopy and weird, and you guys say noir, so I'm like, oh, I guess like a big trench yeah. coat kind of a thing. And then I see this, I was like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, he fucks. <laughs> that that gunhead fucks. Yeah. yeah, yeah, no, he he. It's really cool too. It's a type of protagonist too, where at least within his own, um, call it like neighborhood or sector or whatever, like everybody fucking knows him, yeah. and everyone's like, oh, that's that's fucking. Does everyone love him. Some people love him. Some people are afraid of him. Yeah, it's but, kind of. But the, I, I think they're afraid of him for the right reasons, or or, yeah. or maybe not. And there's some people that are like, "Oh my god!" and extend it, and they're like, "No, no, 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 that's resolver. Right. He's chill." Yeah, Aww. okay. It's yeah. it's I I'm digging it. Yeah, the, yeah, me too. I don't want to. Again, I don't want to spoil it, but just for people who have seen it, the 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 my favorite thing about the end of the episode is they had a perfect place to end the episode, like one scene sooner. Yeah, they but did. because they didn't, it was like such a stronger hook for me to go Ooh. watch the second. Episode. There was the way that episode yeah. ends. I was like. Yeah, I remember thinking of you when I yeah. watched that too. Yeah. I was no, like, I, get that. I was like, if Carrie watches this, yeah. he's gonna fucking love that yeah. ending. Was I right? I, you're 100 percent right. Fuck yeah, yeah. I, yeah. It's definitely on my list. I haven't seen any yet, so yeah. y'all fun. are definitely I'm, uh, making me. Really you can uh, Funimation. You can watch it on Hulu as well. Oh, it's oh, on cool. Hulu. Yep. I I think, I'm cool. watching it on Hulu. I think Funimation most of their stuff comes out on Hulu slightly mm. afterwards. Yeah. Mm. Here's the thing that confused <laughs> me: uh, you do have to have just standard subtitles turned on as an option on Hulu for yes. it to, because I, I it played and it was like sub, it started playing and there's no That's subtitles. That's a relatable thing. And I'm like, wait, mm-hmm. what? What is happening? And then I, yeah, you have learn. to go into your settings Which and turn Which is great if you're trying to learn Japanese. It's you true. can turn off, because Crunchyroll won't let you turn off subtitles. Yeah. Really? At least on mobile. You, just, so, you get a little piece of paper. Slightly yeah. annoying. Yeah. Just, um, <laughs> no, because <laughs> Amazon is the exact same way where uh, yeah. you have to turn on subtitles, but then if you're watching something else, you then have to go turn off yeah. the subtitles, and it's I don't just, need to read Steven Universe. No, yeah, I just I I'm I've reached a point where I just put subtitles on everything. Yeah, no. I'm just old inside. I I am hearing impaired. Yes, thank you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
I actually understand things a lot better if I read it as well. Yeah, it just, yeah I just sometimes when I'm watching something, it gives away the punchline. Yes, yeah. I fair. hate it when you see a sentence, and even if you're not trying to read it, but you see the like two dashes, and you're like, oh well, someone's gonna get interrupted before they that finish is, this, yep. and it might yeah. be because oh they got shot. Yeah, okay. Yeah, right, sure, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, I knew that was coming. <laughs> yeah. Or you know, yeah, yeah. it telegraphs. Caleb so hard. City has a great video about that, about when the subtitles oh, yeah? in an anime give away what's about to happen. Yes, <laughs> that's really funny. <laughs> yeah. So there's, uh, yeah, I've seen we've seen one episode. Uh, as we're recording this, there's two out. Mm. So by the time you're watching this, there might be three. Cool. Depending on when it comes yeah. out. So, yeah, probably. Yeah. I'm I'm definitely gonna keep it up. Yay, yeah. Wow. Um East, do you want to go next or do you want me to go next? I I, I can go. All I've right. been watching Food Wars every day. Hell yeah. <laughs> Cole's really Finally, excited. I'm so excited. Yeah. Name I haven't heard in a long time. So fourth season is out now. Yes. Um, on Crunchyroll. And the only way I got around to watching it was I just sat down, I'm sitting in someone's living room, and they just put it on. <laughs> so, people ask us, do you guys get this a lot where people ask you, how do you get people to watch an anime? Yes. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, what anime do I present people <laughs> to watch? <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. Like, my brother, oh, growing up, hates, like, was like, oh, I hate anime. Like, mm -hmm. I don't like chibi, I don't like that stuff. I'm mm -hmm. a, I'm a football, I hate, sports I hate ball fun. boy. Yeah. He, he likes it now. Um, Good. How we got to that point was... Clicker uh, training, like a dog. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> you just go in a room and turn it on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then mm -hmm. people walk by and they're like, what's this stupid thing? Uh, I'm going to sit down and watch it just to make fun of it. You're like, okay, cool. Yeah. Next then, episode. Exactly. And then they're, they're like, like, there was this and it's like, no, put the next one on. Yeah, 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 I, <laughs> like, yeah it was pretty stupid. Uh, you put the next one though. I, I, yeah. like, I like making fun of so it. So what you're saying is your brother's a Sundari. Oh, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyone who doesn't like anime is a Sundari. <laughs> 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 um, but uh, funny enough, I started it First, because of the first two episodes of season four came out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and I was just there. So most of the time, the person I was watching with, they were just kind of keeping me up to date. I was like, oh, I understand all the tropes. I like, mm -hmm. I don't necessarily need an explanation, but I'll listen. So you yeah. hadn't seen any? I hadn't seen any gotcha. prior okay. to. I'd only read the first chapter of the manga mm -hmm. at that point. They chill out a lot on the fan service stuff as the series goes yes, on. Yes. The, okay. he, he, the, the person I was watching with, they also said that as well. Um. So the thing is, eventually it came to a point where they were like, I'm just, I'm just going to put the first season. I was like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I won't so then, stop you. I won't stop you. <laughs> they keep looking at me and I'm like, mm -hmm, yeah, keep going, keep going. So um, now I'm at the point where I'm pretty invested. I remember all the characters. Um, uh, the best girl is uh, Tadokoro. Which one's uh. her? Oh, are you an Arena? I'm an Ikumi. Oh, please. Ik oh, you yeah. are. Ikumi is the fan service chick. May no. I, with that, as someone that's only watched the first episode, right now, can each of you make a case for your respective best yeah. girls? I've only seen like the first like six episodes. So. Kyle, uh, could you bring up a picture of Nikumi and I K U M I? Also, I put on my best girl judging cowboy hat yeehaw. Uh, and once yeah. you see her, my my case will stand. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. So hold on. Are you saying that your entire defense is going to be based entirely okay. on a picture? I can I do mean, more. I think that may not be fair. I because I want to know who these people are. Okay, so this okay, is I remember her. Mikumi. Nikumi, yes. Mikumi. She's known Ikumi, as Mikumi. But Niku means meat, and her family owns uh Japan's largest largest Kobe um, beef distributor. Yeah, Kobe okay. Beef. Um what makes her best? She's a Sundere. Okay. Good. Um, Great. Good. And yeah. she <laughs> saves the day most of the time because stupid uh Soma needs meat. Okay. And where's he gonna get it from? Okay. Her her nickname in the school is the Meat Master. <sighs> Issa, you got a tough hill to climb. <laughs> All right, Issa, who's your best girl from Food no, Wars? Oh, your best girl tries her best. She, that's the thing. That's why she's the best girl. She tries her best. Um, that's typically Tadokoro. Yeah. T a d o k o r o. That second Megami. one. Yeah. Megami. Oh my! She's she's your classic girl next door. She tries her best. She has low self confidence, but it? really, you just want to get her through college. Yes. <laughs> is that it? Is that it? Issa gets it. Is that a Nendoroid with with like holding a fish? Up? That's great. Yeah. Yeah. She comes from a fishing village. <gasps> That's oh a, shit! I don't know. Oh, there's a Tadokoro. Oh, oh shit! What if what if instead of having to pick one, they fell in love and then? Yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. Who's, for who's sure. your best boy? Oh, I haven't met everyone. Okay. So, yeah. so, so, if you guys haven't known, Food Wars is like one of the biggest tournament um, anime manga that's out there now, and mm -hmm. it's about cooking. They basically mm -hmm. put Iron Chef, mm -hmm. but in high school, and as an anime. Oh, look, they found the so perfect good. image. So good, so good. Yay! 
I'll look at the two of them together. See, we don't have to pick. We don't yeah. have to pick. Well, um, that image wins. <laughs> <laughs> that image is best girl. <laughs> that image fucks. <laughs> 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 nice, 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 nice. 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 <laughs> <laughs> um, so, uh, Food Wars is a follows the main character, the protagonist, um, uh, Soma, Soma Yukihira Yuki Soma, who comes from like a uh, classic. Mm. Japanese old school diner, like family he, style. Family style. Yeah, he used right. to serve as serve customers, and then he decides to go to this up, up and pretentious like cooking school, Totsuki. Because his dad, because a his chef, dad right? is a chef, yeah, and right. his dad challenges him. So Soma actually ends up transferring into the school, not because um his food was good, yeah. But the the big twist is that like the person who is in charge of judging her name is arena mm-hmm. she hates him so much so she says no based on a bias even though his food was delicious but yes. her grandpa tasted his her his food and he decides to transfer her in oh, yeah. yeah and you know it's delicious because like anytime anybody eats good food in that show they nut yeah. yes like, yes and so yes. you see people nut yeah so the fun like it's very um i'm gonna use a lot of terms that the the person i've been watching um food wars uses like nut uh like nut um they always go oh it gets really rude soon that's very good that's very good very it's, oh, yeah. it, this is the rudest thing you'll ever see yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so um they'll he'll always they'll always warn me before it happens <laughs> and he goes it's gonna get rude really soon i was like okay cool thanks but um what was the other thing that they say oh F, I forgot Based already. It. <laughs> it. It's like the GTA game, yeah. just with like a ladle. But oh, here's this. Um, he goes. He was saying is like, uh, you know, it gets rude a lot, but at least with food wars, it's equal opportunity rude. Yes, <laughs> I'm about that. I'm so, so about that. No. At first, it's a lot of girls, but there's so many naked guy mm, shots. Yeah. yeah, that was what. That's what how I really came around on Kill a Kill. Same. Yeah, yeah. that's right. The, the the constantly undressing professor. And yeah, the constantly yeah. undressing well, professor. There's the dude that like the masochist that's just like yeah, yeah. punish. Oh. It's, it's I guess it's like quality over quantity because in the first episode, like the one girl. Who's right. like he makes food gasm first? Yeah. She makes her underlings try it, and all their those dudes. Oh all yeah, like, oh, yeah. Oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's yeah. a question, and there's no right answer to this. I'm just curious. What? Because I think we all agree, like rude moments. Yes. But <laughs> equal opportunity is good. Yes. yes. What's better to have? Uh, what's the fucking uh butt show? Oh, K Joe. K Joe. Is it to like? Is it that for every K Joe there needs to be a free, or that? I'm it should be like that. food wars where I love both. I mean, I, there's like, no right or wrong yeah. answer. I mean, it's like everything's great, but it's like mm. what's what's better? Is it to have like I think whatever a focused show, if I, you will. I think whatever you're better executing. Mm. That's good. Yeah, because that's the thing I like about food wars is like yeah, there's there's genuine reasons for every every gender to nut. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know, and like that's good. Wait, can that be the episode title? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Every generation. Not. Yeah, we're gonna get. Yeah, definitely not demonetized. That's <laughs> yeah. for everyone. That's for everyone. <laughs> Good I, God. The interesting thing about the anime that I've so I've only seen like 10, uh, 11 episodes. Mm. The interesting thing about the anime is um, the way they hook you mm-hmm. is the one episode they'll do the setup. Mm. Here's the problem. Here's mm. the exposition. Um, this is what the characters have to face. And then it's usually like the other person cooking, but they always end it with the question, what's Soma going to do? So then that's the hook because you're like, wait, what is he going to do? So then you're kind of just like, I don't mind watching the next one. Yeah, <laughs> I, have, reaction. Yeah. I have, I think most of the manga that's out in volume form right now is awesome because the chapter breaks will be the recipes for what they're cooking. Cute. Yeah. So I'll oh have to let God. you borrow them sometime. Please. <laughs> <laughs> that would be amazing. Yeah. It's so good. But I, it, so far, it's it's like very, it's very fun. I see why it's so popular, mm. and I think the art style. Not a knock on it. I I'm gonna say the word, um, appealing and generic. I think it's kind of your, sure. it looks like anime, mm. Uh, mm. what a stereotypical anime would be. But that's where a lot of the appeal is, though. Is yeah. it looks very nice, right? Like all, um, it there is a lot of appeal with the style. It's not like super crazy. It's not like, it's not like grim. Um, mm-hmm. It's palatable. And I feel like it, uh, just from what I remember watching, like it, it does a good job of being like 
yeah, kind of like you said, like pr pretty pretty normal for anime. Mm. But then when they do the food stuff, they can go a little bit more detailed with it, yeah. and it still all fits in. It just then feels like the good version of like the Ren and Stimpy shot, where it's like <laughs> yeah. zoomed in and all yeah. fucked up. Yeah. But it says the it the beautiful version. Heightens it. Yeah. Exactly. It's yeah. also it's also like the 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 source of the big action is so. Um, unusual. I think the fact that it looks yeah. pretty standard adds that. In the same way, yeah. like, a, you know, a lot of early, like, mature animation mm -hmm. in the West, part of the, the shtick is like, oh, it looks like it's a show for kids, but don't let your kids watch yeah. this Simpsons. Oh, right. Like, you yeah. know, it was like, it was that sort of thing. And so it's like, you present something that looks like your stereotypical, like, shown in anime, mm -hmm. and then you get to the hook, which is, oh, the action is food gas oh, yeah. yeah or they're yeah. nutting yeah. Yeah. yeah 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 right it's um so so far i i really enjoy it. it it's definitely one of those like oh, okay cool uh mm. there's been so many moments where the character says something and like the subtitles will come on so it, it's like I'm, i already know what happens next but it's also because it is very troperific mm. <laughs> uh it it fills every kind of box every standard like anime shonen box so most yeah. of the time there's this one where it's like but you have to follow this rule. And I go, the other girl has to cook it. And the person I'm watching with goes, yep, you're right. <laughs> I'm like, I knew it. I always, I always figure it out, but I'm still enjoying myself. That's of what, I like one of those. Cause like, I think we talked a little bit about it during uh demon slayer talk mm -hmm. is that it's, I mean, we, we use the word deconstructionist. Mm. It's taking that like normal shonen kind of like, but instead of punching harder, what if you cooked better? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Punch Whoa. him in the mouth with flavor. Yeah. You kick the roast. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's I, kind of it. Like, I forgot I can use my left hand to spice. Yeah. <laughs> I can kick the oven door closed. <sighs> <sighs> I just, I, I, yeah. I mean, that's, I think it's the same reason I was digging No Guns Life too. I just like over the top stuff. Yeah, yeah. And, so uh, yeah, like, absolutely. Yeah. Some over the top anime today, huh? What about you, Coley? What have you been watching? Usually the most over the top. <laughs> uh, this one. What? What if it's what if it's not over the top today? It's under the bottom. It's a little bit. I mean, I'm gonna be on my uh, I'm gonna be on my harm trash <laughs> that's, today. That's the episode today. Yeah, harm trash. <laughs> I'm on my harm trash today. Nice. Um, there's a, a little like show. That? I didn't preview it whenever we were. We didn't preview it whenever we were looking through the stuff before. Mm -hmm. Um, just because I was like, oh, okay, like I'll probably watch this. I'm not sure how much. You were ashamed. A little bit. I was also. I'm not sure how much other people are gonna want to see this. That's fair. Hey, Carrie. Yeah. What has Cole ever done in the history of you knowing him that has led you to believe that this man has shame? That is a very good point. He's shameless. He's and shameless, Uncle Cole. In the same way, <laughs> the horny cell. In the same way that when this is way too long of a story. That's what scares me. <laughs> <laughs> that's what scares me. Hit me. So, Hit me, Cole. Um, or a Suki. It oh. is. Or a Suki is. Uh, the the English name is. So you are the only one who loves me. Okay. 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 Sounds very romantic and beautiful. Kind of All like right. a like yeah, a Nicholas yeah. Sparks so anime. We open up with our homeboy Joro. All right. Joro's going to school and you hear the pitter patter behind him. And who's this? It's uh Himawari, his longtime childhood friend. She got toast in her mouth? No, but she slaps him in the back real hard. Oh, yeah. okay. Nice. And then gives I'm him... assuming they're all of age too, nice, right? Nice, 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 no. Nice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> yes, they are. Oh, and, and they sure are drawn that way. In Japan, they're, okay, all, they're okay. all sixteen and up. All right. Okay. Is that hey. of age? Yes. Yeah. In Japan. Yeah. I think so. I'm about to look um, that up, man. You're gonna look it up. Please do. I mean, there's some states that's seventeen. You're gonna get put on a list, Isa. Texas is weird. <laughs> Texas is like incognito. There's incognito. certain. Yeah, it's weird. Anyways, okay. Um. Yeah. And so he's like, everything's fine. Hey, this is my friend Himawari. We've been friends since we were little. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, we're gonna go to school. Wow, she sure is cute. Um, luckily, who's he we, talking to? Me, the, me. So it's so far, this is the opening to Doki Doki Literature Club. Yeah, <laughs> Let's see if it keeps going. <laughs> so he gets to his classroom, and there's his best friend in the entire world, Sunshine. What's up, okay. Sunshine? He's this baseball star. Okay. Mm. He's like, hey, uh, I'm gonna hit all the home runs, and um, he's like, hey, uh, what what do you do walking together? Uh, you guys are best friends, and he uh, Jordan was like, well, like an albatross around my neck. And she gets very upset oh. and like walks away. And he was like, "Hey, man, you gotta be nicer. You can't do this." Yeah, negging's not, not cool. Not right now. And then uh, her response. Also, yeah. he says a very scared look on her face. I don't like the answer. Oh. Is that fourteen? What? Um. What is so, the age of consent in Japan? Um. So, uh, how do I put it? Uh, so there's a thing. At what age? Google results. At what age do Japanese people officially become adults? Is twenty. Age of consent. Is thirteen. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay, okay. All right, edit this out. <laughs> no, the people should know. Oh, God. Uh, we'll talk about this, Kyle. We'll talk about what? it again. Kyle, Kyle is getting...
giving like a uh, disappointed Do dad. not hit that nice, 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 nice. <laughs> Do not hit that nice, 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 nice. Ooh. So they're 16 and 17 in this. So, okay. Okay. So, okay. so okay. practically middle-aged. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so uh, then who should walk through the door behind I'm him? Worried about their mortgage. But the honey herself, the student council president. Honey herself. So she walks in. She's okay. like, hey, uh, Joro, you're part of student council. Why don't we have a talk? Okay. So they all go, uh, and uh, Himawari gets upset because she, she doesn't like the student council president. Of course. Or okay. she's jealous. It's too old. All right, so we got to get through some things. So, <laughs> needless to say, both Himawari and the president, oh, her name is Cosmos. Uh, they both, um, they're like, hey, good. Joro, uh, we, we got, you want to hang out this weekend? Mm-hmm. He's okay. like, oh, yeah. And he kind of likes both of them. He's like, okay, okay like I kind of like both sure. these girls. Like, yeah. they're both pretty. I'm 16. That's yeah, he's got 16. I'm riddled with hormones. Yeah. He's got to settle down soon. Yeah. <laughs> so then, um, he's like, yeah, sure. So he goes on the, his first date with Cosmos, and while okay. he's on the date, they have this wonderful time. They see all these movies, yeah. and um, you know, they get done. They uh, sun setting. Sure. Sit down, and she's like, hey, will you sit with me real quick? He's like, yeah, sure. What's what's up? So she's like, I have something to tell you. There's so, I'm so nervous right now. There's someone I like, and she's like, "What?" And she like leans in, looks at him, and her uh-huh. lips get big and puffy, and she's like, "I like your best friend, Sun Chan." <gasps> bum bum bum. Yeah, okay. you could have guessed that from the title. Like, you're the only one who likes me. Um, okay. so uh, uh, he's like, "Oh," she's like, "Yeah," but here's the thing: Will you help me get with him? Mm-hmm. And he's like, "Yeah, you know, what? like, yeah, sure." Uh, so then the next day happens Working and he goes mistake. on dates with Working Himawari mistake. and she's he's like, oh, we're having fun. And he looks and she's like, oh yeah, like, hey, wait, oh, keep I, going. I have keep something going. to tell you. Oh, no. And he turns and that same bench is there. And she goes and sits on the bench. She's like, there's someone I like. And she gets close and looks up and her lips get all puffy. And she goes, I'm in love with your best friend, Sun Chan. I knew it. But wait, is there more? Uh, so... How they fell in love with him was a long time ago, there had been a baseball game. Remember? He was the baseball star. I remember. Remember, yeah. Miles. So, he went, they were like, oh, yeah, when, he, when they lost that baseball game, he encouraged the entire team. We were like, oh, that's weird. You're the reason you lost, but you're encouraging your entire team. So then, they go under the bleachers and check out what's going on, and he's hitting his head against the wall. And one girl was on the West Hall, and one girl was on the East Hall. So that's how they didn't see each other. Okay. And they both fell in love with him there. Who knew? So that... Himawari asks her, asks uh, Joro to help her. This is when the turn happens. Okay, please tell me this is what I'm thinking. Keep going. He turns out to be a complete asshole, Joro. He was trying to get with both of them all along, and he's like, okay, well, here's the deal. Like, he's just like, oh, you bitches. Like, you're going to use me to get oh with this guy. Oh, my God. Um, he's like, hey, but hey, here's the deal. One of them's going to fail. Oh my like god. Like one of them has oh to succeed. My god. Oh my god. So I'm gonna help them get with him. I'm gonna help both of them equally. And he flat tells me, like, yeah, like the other one asked me to help. I'm gonna help you both because I like both of you. Like I'm I'm <sighs> friends with both of you, so I'm gonna help. But here's the deal. Please. Every day during lunch he goes to the library and there's this one girl who nobody likes in the library. Cause that's where she's hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> who the what? fuck reads? Yeah. So she goes, Hey, I know what you're doing. And if you go back and watch all of the scenes, she was creeping on him the entire time. Oh, okay. <laughs> Every scene, she was in the background. She's like, here's the deal. He's like, don't say it. Look over there. I have something to tell you. In the middle of their library is the bench. <laughs> 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 she goes, okay, that's turn, amazing. Turn, that's amazing. She had it delivered. <laughs> so that's she goes and turns good. and like, Joro, I have to tell you something. There's someone I like. It's you. <gasps> Boom. The only one who likes him is the girl he doesn't like. Okay. Here's... Okay. I was not interested. That kind of won me over at the end a little bit. Yes. The bench that absurdity shit is good. <laughs> I would like to propose something that would be... That I was hoping for. That yeah. would have been like 10 times better. Is if he sat down with Sun Chan. Him and Sun Chan got together? And Sun Chan leaned in and said, I like you. Yeah. So here's uh, the thing. Episode two. <gasps> is that what I mean? <laughs> there were three episodes in. Episode two... Uh, him and Sunshine have a talk. He goes, "Hey, we have to have a talk." Oh, does he? I turns and sees the bench. Goes and sits down. He's in love with the girl that's in love with. Yeah, him. there it is. Yep. There it is. There I, it is. I, I won't spoil anymore because the, okay. the third episode, I think fourth episode, comes out this week. So next week we'll be closing oh. on the when this when this episode of fan service airs. The fifth episode will be coming out. Okay. 
Wow. Um, okay, I'm wow. I'm a little bit more invested. Yeah, now. no, me too. That I'm actually sounds really funny. They're all like assholes, and I that's love good. it. Okay, okay, so that's good. Okay, so it's like great. an always sunny. That's kind of great. Yes. Always, okay. a little bit always sunny. Um, there was a show that came out a, a few years ago. Uh, Gamer, and Greg. Gamers oh, okay. that Austin uh, that, and I really liked. That reminds me of that. It's yeah. very similar to Gamers and another show. Um, it's like a mix of Gamers and oh, no. Ore Gairu, which mm. is uh, my teen romantic comedy snafu, <laughs> which is this like drama about like a guy who has social anxiety, like interacting with people and being forced to like make friends. Mm. So, okay, okay. I'm, um, yeah. This show is like, was, I was like, like I said, I was like, I don't think many people are going to like this. It's, mm-hmm. oh, here's a kid who's wanting to get with a bunch of girls, but only one girl likes him. Oh, like, the execution is so good. I want to check it out. I legitimately nice. want to check it out. Where do you yeah. watch it? Uh, funny. 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 Okay, cool. so funny. Funimation. Hulu. Yeah. So. That's really funny. Um, That's, yeah. I kind of want to get that bench. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, I want a Nindo of that bench. You have to be there hey, anytime gosh. you need to have a conversation with a friend. Yeah. Hey, hey can we go to the bench? Can, like, can, can we have a talk? He keeps like interjecting it with English. Like the second time he sings the bench, she's just, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> um so um has anybody watched My Hero? I did. Oh, I yeah, did watch I did. My Hero. I, I didn't yet because isn't the first episode kind of recap? First episode, maybe? fucking skip it. You don't need to first watch the first episode. Recap. Second, second episode out. out. Yeah. Second oh, episode's out. I missed it. It's every Saturday. Um, I'm gonna have to spoil a thing for you because I can't. Do we want? To... I can't not talk about a small thing okay. in this episode. Oh, I know what you're gonna talk you about. You know exactly what I'm gonna talk about. That's okay. Um, it hurts. It's and it's, so it, a lot it's of okay. it is a lot of it is a reminder of kind of like there. There's some cool shit that goes down. Mm-hmm. Which I don't know if I want to talk about if you haven't seen it yet. Um, I can leave. This is we can do what the fuck we want. We have I some we leave. have some very cool developments on the antagonist side. We will get into oh, a lot of my no. hero talk. So very, I don't, yes, we will be getting into a lot of my hero talk this season. Okay, so we can we can be a little ambiguous while, right now. Yeah, while <laughs> we're in this space specifically of yeah, kind of yeah. the stuff that we were just talking about, I want to talk about one thing. Yeah. So there's mm-hmm. a uh, there's some really cool antagonist stuff mm-hmm. that I'm excited for you to see. Um, but the 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 part of the storyline that we're picking up with Deku from last season is oh we're about to do this like internship with green hair type thing <laughs> yeah big guys green Naruto black? green Naruto green Naruto oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Green, no 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 green that's, that's Rock Lee that's Rock Lee oh green oh. green Boruto's dad there yes, we go yes, thank yes, you yes, yes, yes. Um, do you he's got to go find his son's named Bur- burrito I'm sorry Stop. no what it, Wait, Christian what? Bale's son's named burrito no it's go not. on go on I can't I don't Kyle can you just check that while we're Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm taking my hat off, if that's true, for just as a moment of respect for Burrito. Yeah. Um, so, uh, Deku needs to go find someone to study under. His name is Joseph Bale. What is wrong with you? What did I see? <laughs> Ghosts? <laughs> I don't know. An article? I don't know. Look up Burrito Bale. Wait, are Christian Bale's <laughs> kids really named Banana and Burrito? What? Who's <laughs> spreading this? What is the? This is not anime. Okay, no, I can't. I can't. No, C- tell me the thing. He calls okay. his kids banana and burrito. Okay, sure, that's, that's fine. fine. I. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. He's that's Christian fine. Bale. He can it's do whatever he wants. He's fucking hungry because he like starves himself for rolls half the time. <laughs> he just it's Probably like a Looney Tunes. Tunes. Yeah, it's yeah. a Looney Tunes cartoon. Sometimes his right. like son transforms into an image of a burrito, <laughs> and it just accidentally comes out because he's driven for his new role. Yeah, Sorry, whatever, burrito. I'm yeah. Joseph. Whatever you say, burrito. Here's yeah. your allowance. Well, there's, Dad, I'm, no. I mean, it is going to be in this. I know in the next spring season, there's a. Uh, um, I'm hungry and I want to eat my kids. So I mean that this all play really Star- well. hats back on <laughs> hats back on his most uh, method acting yet he becomes <gasps> an anime. My Deku hero. My yeah. Hero. Yeah. needs to go and get uh, a teacher essentially for okay. a potential internship thing, and uh, the person he's going to go after is uh, All Might's old sidekick. Okay, and uh, Mister Naked uh, Translucent Boy, I can't yes. remember the fuck his name. Um, uh, Vault Boy, Pit Boy, Mirio. Yeah, Pit Boy, Mirio, Mirio. Mirio. Yeah. He's going to introduce him. Yeah. And uh, Deku's going to go meet this guy. And the thing that he's told mm-hmm. is like, so this dude, he's like rail thin. He looks like Mandark. He's essentially anime Mandark. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> and he's like, this dude is fucking scary. Yeah. He's like no nonsense dude. But Pip-Boy tells him, I'm going to tell you the secret. And you have to do this or he will not accept you. Tickle him. You have to get this guy to laugh. Oh. Because he appreciates humor over Everything else. If you can't get this guy to laugh, he's never going to take you on. Okay. Okay. And he says this right before they go in the door. Okay. 
This is when we now get through the through the magic of storytelling. We oh. are transported inside his office, where he's getting a briefing from his current sidekick, who's um like a mermaid girl. Her name's. Bob. I would have called her um, Titty Captain um, uh, Cap no Captain Planet. Titty Captain Planet is yeah. what I would have called her because she's blue with like green hair. Her, her official name is Bubble Girl. Her yeah, her name's Bubble. Yeah, she's very cute. Wearing it an sounds outfit. Sounds like it should be bubbles. Wearing Massive an outfit under boob. Massive that under That is essentially just hiding nip. Like just that. Okay. And then the rest is two globes. Okay. And then she's in bubbles. little booty shorts. Bubbles. Bubbles. And she's giving <laughs> she's giving a report to sidekick bubbles. Mr. Mandark. <laughs> and she's going through the whole thing. And then he's like, stop. And she's like, yeah. and he's like, what do you think you're doing? And he gets all of her shit, and she's like, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, sir. I didn't, I didn't mean, I know I should have. And she's like, you know what has to happen now. And she's like, no, please, no. And Deku comes into the office like, sir, I'm here to meet you. And there he is confronted with his young sidekick <laughs> strapped to a device that is tickling her. As she cries, screaming, no, please stop. I'm sorry. No, please. And he's just fucking watching her. Just watching her laugh. <laughs> if that was not in My Hero, I would probably hate that. But that sounds pretty funny. I am just like... Are you traumatized? I'm... Oh, exactly man. where you're at. Okay. If this was not My Hero, I'd be like... Time to hit the old I got a dusty <laughs> chair. Right, yeah. I'm done with anime. Like, I, I'm sitting there and I'm like, they're not gonna play it off as a sex thing, but it looks like a sex thing so hard. Like I, it's very uncomfortable. I am gonna hold out hope that within three episodes, the man himself will be. The tickle. We can only hope for that equal opportunity horniness. We can yeah. only hope. Yeah. Equal opportunity. Um, there is some remarkably funny bits at the end of that episode that I will not spoil. Okay, that okay. was like, I had a laugh out loud reaction to. This, I, that bit threw me off guard. This, this off is the week. start of the best arc oh. in My Hero so far. Oh, it's, it's shit. It's one of the longest as well. I think I this is around in the manga where, um, I've talked about this before, when long, long series starts to get very popular, they start to stretch it out a bit longer. Mm -hmm. um, this is if you, this if you have a good manga. story that can last two episodes, why not make it four? Yeah. Ooh, ah, the okay. Dragon Ball Z approach. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, it's still very interesting. Okay. Yeah. Um, it also this arc has one of my favorite characters. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I really hope that some of that's just like four minutes of tickling. <laughs> that different characters. <laughs> Every, yeah, they were like, well, we got to put something in here. Yeah. Tickling. Yeah. They sure do linger on it. Yeah. <laughs> We just like we we walked in this hall, this facility hallway and there's just rooms of different my hero characters being tickled and we get to the end and Bakugo has been being tickled for 36 hours straight he hasn't laughed once <laughs> I thought you were gonna be like and there's a mirror and Deku was being tickled the entire time <laughs> interested to I'm, see where we go from I'm very here. excited yeah yes. I I just I thought it was only one episode that's so I'm there, totally gonna watch that there's some uh, there's some dope fucking shit that yeah. goes down yeah. in this episode Hell that yeah. is very are, metal are they now like. The, the first episode, is it just 100%? I am telling you right now, yeah. it would pro you would probably feel like it's a waste of time to watch the first okay. episode. I can't, think of anything, well. I can't think of anything really notable. It really, it's not even, it goes over who all the characters are. I was going to say, it's like, I don't remember like 100%. It is I a refresher it. probably for people. It's like, hey, it's been a while since you've seen it. If okay. you're not like, if, you're, if you binged it one, like, yeah, yeah, one yeah. period, it's like, hey, we need to okay. have you remember. I'll start out, I'll probably skip it. Okay. I've heard it's good. I've heard it's good for a recap episode. Yeah. Mm. Um, it was good except for the like five yeah. minutes where they literally went through the roster of characters in class one A and said, here's their name and here's what they do. Okay. I don't need to see that. <laughs> yeah. 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 But like I mean yeah. and here's what they look like being tickled. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been awesome. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe watch that. And when I when episode two started, um I was kind of just like, oh, hmm. Uh I forgot already that that's what happened because I totally skipped the first episode, the recap. So when they're like, Oh, I'm gonna do internship, I was like Oh, oh, oh is yeah. it the world ending? I don't even remember them mentioning it in the recap, if I'm being honest. Mm, never mind then. Oh, yeah. man. That'd be like a great death for Mineta. Tickle to death? Yeah. Yes. By now, a, like a, a, death that he, a death that he considers great or a death that is great no, for the someone, viewer? Because someone a death like, that he considers great is just like a very sexy, getting sat on to death. <laughs> a very sexy villainess is like, hey, why don't you come in this room and... All your dreams will come true. And he's like, "Jokes on you! I already came in this outfit." <laughs> he's like, "All right," yeah. and he goes in there, and that's the why I'm wearing a diaper. And he dies from tickling. <laughs> yeah. 
No, see, I was thinking that like it would be bad for him because he's getting tickled to death, which should be great, but it's by a machine and not a lovely lady, and mm. so that would be the problem. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's right. like a boomer doing it. Uh, I think we're almost about time. Uh, before we go, <laughs> I, I do want to give a shout out to Ooh, yeah. uh, Chanel yeah. Fruit Bat. Yeah. Made these lovely. Here, I'll do this angle. They're very Aww. good. Angle. It's right. We have it right here. They're very good. Um, made us these lovely coasters. It's our our birthday gift. Thank Yay. you. Happy birthday, Thanks, Chanel. I wanted to put it there to display it. Yeah. This is um. Yeah, and we'll I, be back. What's up? Oh, I was gonna say I'm 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 super excited. As of course I'm excited for more of my hero, but I'm yeah. actually super interested to see what continues to happen with No Guns Life. Yeah, me too. That's where I'm at right now. The... Yeah. I also have a question. We can, we can cut this, Kyle. Maybe if if we think it's mm -hmm. depending on what the answer is. So. Everyone always asks me, how do I watch Fate? Okay, and Fate okay. Grand Order is very good, but it's hard to explain where it fits into all this. Okay. In a future episode, should we have a primer? Yes. I think it'd be good. Sure. I mean, okay. I'm, I'm always open to I'm doing to a little things. research right now to see how do I explain it, because essentially <gasps> the uh, um, the current anime that's airing right now yeah. is the seventh part of the first story in Fate. Grand mm. Order, the mobile game. Mm. So there are six other parts that happen in the lead up that I'm like, the exact thing. Like people are like, that seems like a lot for right. me to get into right. to watch this thing. If there's a primer, yeah, I was wondering, could that help people? Cole, I feel like you're gonna need to like unravel this one, like Polygon unraveled this one. Yeah, or I mean, we could also go the other way with it and like go more ASMR, and people can like fall asleep to it. Or what I'm hearing, so, no matter what option there, we first, choose, there was singularity F. <laughs> what I'm hearing is, no matter what option we choose, if we really want to prep ourselves to watch and jump into fate, it means that we're gonna have to listen to Cole explain. Mm -hmm. Hey, you did that this episode already. We did this year. When he started explaining the first episode, I was like, "Oh, here we go." Oh no! I even said, "Honey, oh. can we?" <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the thing the that whole explain segment is back. No, I would love it. Nothing more. There will be an episode of fan service. This is just happening now, where none of us are. None, the, there's no, none of us here. Are here, it's just Cole sitting on the bench. <laughs> yes, please. And, and he's gonna explain fate to you all. We'll be here. We're listening. I want you guys to we ask questions. Okay, I, we'll be here. We'll yeah, be here. Okay. We'll have two benches. I won't do it in Goofy Cole Explains. I'll do it real so that way people can understand. I promise. I appreciate the fact that you said that we all know that's not possible. <laughs> <laughs> but I, you're going to try, and we love you for it. Until next time, just go watch anime. Yes. Yeah. And tell your friends about the show. Tell your Please. friends. We're trying to get the word out that we're on YouTube now. Like, yeah. comment, subscribe. Hit the bell. All Ring that, that bell. shit that Smash you gotta do. the bell. To help yeah. us get more views. Put that bell. Throw that bell on the bench. Have it sit there. Have a good talk. A good long talk <laughs> with that bell. Yeah. Tell it you love it. We'll see you next right. time. Bye. Peace.